science for it. Objectives Explain the uses of water from different sources in the context of daily activities. How well do you know about sources and uses of water? Let us try to find out by answering the following question. Are you ready, kids? Let's go! Directions Read the sentences carefully. Write your answer on your notebook. Number 1. What do you call to the one of the most essential substances on the planet, which all plants and animals need to live, and which is also vital to the human body? A. Food B. Land C. Plant D. Water Your timer starts now. Good job! The correct answer is letter D. Number 2. Which of the following terms describes the kind of salt-free water present in open yet small bodies of water, such as rivers, streams, creeks, and ponds? A. Seawater B. Rainwater C. Freshwater D. Groundwater Your timer starts now. The correct answer is letter C, fresh water. Number 3. Which of the following describes the kind of water located under the earth's crust and derived from seepage into the ground? A. Seawater B. Rainwater C. Freshwater D. Groundwater Your timer starts now. Time is up! What is your answer? Amazing! The correct answer is letter D. Number 4. What term do you use to describe a salty water that contains a lot of salt? A. Seawater B. Rainwater C. Freshwater D. Groundwater Your timer starts now. The correct answer is C. Water. Number 5. What do you call those waters comes from clouds and it flows from land into streams and rivers? A. Sea water. B. Rainwater. C. Fresh water. D. Groundwater. Your timer starts now. Time is up! What is your answer? The correct answer is letter B, rain water. Kids, do you know that water can be obtained from a variety of places? It can originate from public or private sources. It can be originate from small and large body of water. Water is a very precious and important natural resource on earth. All living things like human beings, plants, and animals need water to survive. About 70% of our earth is covered with water. So what are the sources of water? Rainwater, surface water, Groundwater and sea water. Rainwater is the water that falls from the sky during rainstorm. It can be collected in containers and used for various purposes. Surface water is a water that is found in rivers, lakes, and streams. It is usually the easiest source of water to find and use. Next is groundwater. Groundwater is water that is found beneath the earth's surface. It is stored in rocks and soil. 
and can be accessed through wells. The next one is sea water. Sea water is the water found in oceans and seas. It is not suitable for drinking but can be used for activities like swimming and boating. Now, since we know the sources of water, we're going to proceed to the uses of water. One of the mga uses of water. First is drinking. Water is essential for human survival and drinking clean water is important for maintaining good health not only human but also plants and animals needed water next is bathing and hygiene so water is used for washing our bodies and keeping ourselves clean and hygienic next is cooking water is used in cooking to boil steam and wash food Agriculture Water is essential for growing crops and raising livestock. Like what I said a while ago, water is very important to plants and animals for their survival. Next is Industry Water is used in many industries such as manufacturing, mining, and energy production.